welcome to Web Idiots. I'm Sean Welby and we don't have a theme tune. Ugh, I've only just noticed. Awkward. Well, I can't just start talking randomly without an introduction, can I? Oh, well, I have to now. Remind me at the end to sort that one out, yeah? Right, time to update you with that idiot-proof techno update. But first, a quick quiz to get your brains into gear. On average, how many hours does a person spend a week surfing the internet? Is it A, 3.9 hours, B, 10 hours, C, 16.4 hours, or D, 32.7 hours? I'll give you the answers at the end of the show. Ooh, isn't this fun? <sighs> now, with more and more people embracing new technologies and devices, such as smartphones, or as I like to call them, brain phones, you know, the phones that have sat-nav and video, and they can unlock your car, cook your breakfast, wash your dog, shave your legs, and run out of battery whenever you need to make a call, that mobile phone advertising should really take off, driven by new applications and social networking sites such as Facebook and Twitter. It's been predicted that mobile advertising will attract interest from small local retailers who wouldn't normally embrace mainstream online advertising. This way these advertisers could shift their budget from local newspapers directly to mobile phones for local highly targeted campaigns. So if your business needs updating with a new modern technique then maybe mobile phone advertising could be for you and you could be part of the 28 billion dollar industry. Now going back to social networking sites it turns out that apparently celebs and hip adults aren't the only people flocking to Twitter. Apparently, centenarians even know how to tweet. In a recent survey, 3% of US citizens that are over 100 years old claim to use Twitter to stay in contact with friends and family. A further 10% said they used emails to stay connected, 12% said they shared photos online, 4% downloaded music, and 1% said they used Wii Fit to exercise. Now, I just thought that was amazing and so I decided that I'd get loads of photo evidence of we loving old people and I added a bit of music because I thought it was funny. So for all those people out there that are younger than a hundred years old and uh, still text using one finger and try and change the channel using the DVD remote, well sorry but you don't have any excuses anymore. You just need to get with the grannies and get online. Now, I'm sure you're all desperately awaiting the answer to that question earlier. Well, I'll put you out of your misery. The answer was D, 32.7 hours, which is quite a long time. And of all those hours, 84% of the time, people were using search engines, which just goes to show that if you want your business to get noticed, it needs to be online. Now, what was... Ooh, theme tune. Now... I've got to get it good, I've got to get it right, it needs to be catchy and modern, fun, I don't know, uh, possibly plagiarised from a popular 80s film, I don't know, I'm just throwing ideas out here. <sighs> Do something strange with your online sales, who are you going to call? 